show you. I'm going to turn this glass of water into a colourful drink. So I have my water, I have my empty glass. Do you think I can turn this into a colourful drink? Well, here goes, let's see. Well, hey, voila, there we go. Well, are you impressed? This is actually just a trick. I can't really turn water into orange liquid. But today's story is all about when Jesus went to a wedding and he really did turn water into wine. Jesus is invited to a wedding. And when Jesus was alive, weddings could go on for days. People had a lot of time to celebrate together. Now Jesus hadn't begun teaching people about God, but he did already have some followers, a few friends who had left everything to follow him. The wedding was a great chance for them to spend time together. Everything was going well at the wedding until the wine ran out. What? There was no more wine to give to the guests. Let's watch and see what happens. Stories of the Bible. Jesus turns water into wine. This is Jesus. hey -o! Who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. Jesus was born in Bethlehem and grew up in Nazareth where he grew in wisdom and favor with God oh, I see. and man. One day, Jesus, his disciples, and his mother went to a wedding in Cana. In the middle of the party, the wine ran out. Uh oh. So Jesus' mother, Mary, told him, they have no more wine. Aww. Jesus replied, dear woman, that's not our problem. My time has not yet come. Excuse me. But Mary told the servants, do whatever he tells you. Standing nearby were six stone water jars. The Jews used jars like these in their washing ceremony. Jesus told the servants, fill the jars with water. Yeah, okay. When the jars had been filled, he said, now dip some out and take it to the master of ceremonies. So the servants did what Jesus told them to. When the master of ceremonies tasted the water that was now wine, not knowing where it had come from, though of course the servants knew, he called the bridegroom over. A host always serves the best wine first. Then when everyone has had a lot to drink, he brings out the less expensive wine, but you have kept the best until now. This miraculous sign in Cana in Galilee was the first time Jesus revealed his glory and his disciples believed in him. What a fabulous story about Jesus. But what can we learn from this? The disciples spent time with Jesus. We can get to know who Jesus is too by spending time listening to what he does and says in the Bible. Mary knew Jesus was special and she trusted him to have the right plan. She said, do whatever he tells you to do. Jesus invites us to trust him just like Mary and to do what he says just like the servants. This miracle begins to show the disciples who Jesus really is. Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. Why don't you make a question mark memory verse for this week? Mm -hmm. 